Mm. We are in Bogina, in Petrolo Estate. This is the first vineyard planted by my grandfather in 1947. And it's the, let's say, the most beautiful Sangiovese vineyard we have in Petrolo. Um, Bogina, uh, uh, probably the name came from, uh, um, is an Etruscan name. Uh, probably was an Etruscan family who used to live here before the Romans period. And as you can see, it's, a, it's, a, it's, a, it's, a, it's really a very beautiful vineyard, uh, especially for the condition. Great. This vineyard has great condition to produce a great Sangiovese. I think uh, uh, to, to produce a great Sangiovese, uh, I mean, you must have beautiful hands and a very beautiful heart. But first of all, great condition. So great condition, beautiful hands and beautiful heart, it's possible that sometimes make great wines. Uh, great wines, uh, you know, Sangiovese can be a difficult grape. If, if a Sangiovese doesn't have perfect condition, it can be very tough to produce a great Sangiovese. Um, I think in Tuscany we are very lucky especially in the center of Tuscany. We are in, in, in different areas of the center of Tuscany, like in the Montalcino area, or where we are here, uh, more or less in the center of the Chianti, in the southeast part of the Chianti area. We can have, we can find great, great condition to make, uh, to, 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 to grow and to make great Sangiovese, great Sangiovese wines. Um, not everywhere is possible. Uh, not because you are in Tuscany, it's possible to make a grand, uh, everywhere in Tuscany it's possible to make a, a great Sangiovese. In some, this is my, 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 my idea, I think that in, only in some parts of Tuscany it's possible to make a great Sangiovese. You must have really a special, special condition, especially uh, from the soil. Uh, this vineyard has a, um, a very dry, uh, very, very stony, let's say, st a lot of stones in the soil, Galestro, Alberese and Arenaria, uh, the typical stones uh, of the Chianti, of the center of the Chianti. And as you can see, it's very um, uh, st steep, and so uh, the water doesn't, you know, it's very, uh, has a very good uh, uh, drainage. In the southeast part of the Chianti area, which is a, uh, probably a more uh, <coughs> facing the, va the valley of the Arno River. So we have a very special, let's say, uh, uh, microclime. Um, microclime together with special con soil condition, this is, let's say, the magic uh, or the, the, the magic things that can uh, give you uh, a special wine.